Trick or treat doesn't last long in Palmer, but uh, that's okay. I went door to door with Tyler and gave him the entire bag that I got because I was like, fuck it. I got too much shit on my plate right now. I don't even care for candy. So I gave him that. Sarah's going to drive me to school in the morning, so I'll be in wear by 6.30 in the morning. So, yeah. But besides that, I don't know. Sarah just dropped me off at my house. She's going to pick me up from here in the morning. She asked me what kind of coffee I want tomorrow morning because she knows the shit I'm going through. She's like, you want coffee? And I was like, not really. She's like, I'm getting you a coffee. And I was like, okay. She's like, what kind of coffee do you want? I was like, I don't know. Surprise me. She's like, okay, I'll have, I'll let Tyler surprise you. I was like, all right. So, I don't know. I got a lot going on. I just don't know how to deal with shit, I guess. But. I'm going to make shit better. I'm going to better myself because I guess I missed out on a lot today. But, yeah. Hell no, I know there's something good in this pack. I was told there was. No, they didn't. I'm gonna freak out. But whatever. Ugh. I was expecting some weed. Because I was supposed to have weed in that cigarette pack. My grandmother was supposed to give me a joint. But that didn't happen. So, fuck it. I don't need smoke anyways. Marijuana is not a necess necessity. Neither are cigarettes. The only thing that's a necessity in my life is my girlfriend. Tabitha Jen Scott is my world. And she is my necessity. She is everything I need in this world to be happy and be su su blah, 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 successful. And if I ain't got you, then I got nothing. I ain't got myself. I ain't got a life. I ain't got nothing. You are my life. You are my everything. And I can't stress it to you enough. I don't. I tell you every day how much you mean to me. I try to show you how much you mean to me. I give you all my attention and I give you everything. And yes, I understand. I guess I just don't know how to deal with the stuff you go through, I guess. I don't know. I don't know how I'd word that. But, like, yeah. I'm trying to work with us, you, and me all in one. Separately. And... It's just tough. I really, really want to spend the rest of my life with you. And only you. I don't give a fuck about Alyssa Rollins. I do not give a fuck about Caitlyn Henrichon. I give a fuck about you. And you only. You are my forever. You are my world. You are my princess. You're my queen. You're my love. You're my everything. And if I lose that, then I lost everything I've ever cared for in my entire life. Because... In the end, all them past relationships is what made me fall in love with you. That's what made me fall in love with you. And when I tell you I'm in love with you, I'm in love with you. Those fuck-ups made me fall in love with you. Those fuck-ups got me hooked on you. Where I don't want to leave and I don't want nobody but you. And I'm not going to leave for anybody but you. So, it's like... Give me a break, baby. Work with me because I'm trying to work with you. I try to stay 100% with you. I thought I heard my dog, so I just, like, freaked. It's like, wait, why are you out front? But, yeah. It's like, I love you. And I'll buy you the world. I'll buy you anything in the world you want. I, anything... It doesn't have to cost money. It doesn't need anything you want. You can have it. I just want you happy. And I want to be happy with you. I want to be happy with you together. And I'm tired of this shit. I will scream it to the world. Fuck Alyssa Rollins. And fuck Caitlyn Henrichon. They're whores.
I just screamed it. Yelled it pretty loud. My neighbors are outside. Just, I don't want nothing to do with them. I hate them. I want you. If I ain't got you, then I don't even have myself and there's no point in being alive. It's all. It's just me and you. And it's all it's ever going to be is me and you till the day I die. And then you can believe that.